According to Curves on Security, Facebook stored hundreds of millions of passwords in plain text. The password for hundreds of millions of users were exposed for years to anyone who had internal access to the files. User passwords are typically protected with encryption, a process known as hashing. But a string of errors led certain Facebook-branded apps to leave passwords accessible to as many as 20,000 company employees. Facebook confirmed the issue in a blog post titled Keeping Passwords Secure and it said the company identified the problem in January as part of a security review. Facebook says it has fixed the issue and will notify everyone affected. For more details, check out the link in description. This clever scam lets advertisers make money by draining your Android phones. Hidden video ads that nobody ever sees can fool marketers and drain batteries. Remember when we learned it was theoretically possible for a web page or app to steal your processor cycle to mine cryptocurrency, potentially draining your battery and sell your data in the process. According to a report that ad networks have figured out a similar scam. One that lets lucrative, power-hungry video advertisements hide behind the traditional banner ads in Android apps, so users don't even know they are there. According to a report, it's not the app developers to blame. They were surprised too to find out an influx of complaints about why their apps are draining user batteries and eating up more than their fair share of data. Instead, the report suggests that the ad networks they had signed up with had been hijacked by fraudsters within the large ad business. The scam isn't just at the expense of consumers but also ad networks too. As these scammers buy up cheap banner spots and fill them with expensive video ads profiting in the process. To learn more about the advertisement scam, check the link in description. Nintendo's latest Labo Kid lets you code your own VR games. Nearly one year after the launch of Labo, Nintendo's DIY cardboard accessory line for the Switch, the company is releasing its fourth kit and introduction to VR for kids. All the games have to be played with the headset held up to your face, which has its own pros and cons. On one hand, it can make your hands tired holding the Switch screen up for a while. But on the other, some of the mini games are designed to be played in turns and it's quicker to pass the screen around as it to deal with all the fuss of taking a headset on and off. Passing the headset around is meant to encourage both virtual and real world interactions, says Nintendo of America president Dog Browser. Six toy con creations can be made using the DIY, including Blaster camera, elephant, bird, and a petal in addition to a pair of VR goggles. For all the watch lovers, Cash is releasing an incredibly rare version of its road track WSD F30 smartwatch. The Cash WSD F30 SC has just been announced at Basel World 2019 and it features all of the same features of the original watch as well as last year. Where it differs is the design. It has rose gold buttons and deep blue bezel with the line effect. It's also smaller than the original watch in terms of dimension. It also comes with a metal chain link band as well as a stainless steel rear that sits on your wrist. Kasha told the watch would be available in Japan and Europe but it won't be on sale in the US. Kasha isn't even sure if the UK will be one of the markets it's on sale. Even if it is, it may be a bit of scramble to find one as the company only plans to release a thousand of these limited edition watches. Check out the link in description to know more about this incredible watch. Resident Evil 2 raises the bar for video game remakes. With nearly 5 million copies sold on the original PlayStation, RE2 is the series best selling installment on a single platform. Yet somehow it never got a proper remake. Capcom is fixing that this Friday with the release of the FIT titled Resident Evil 2 for PC, PS4 and Xbox One. All the gamers check out the link in description for the trailer of RE2. If you like the video, click on the thumbs up button and subscribe with QGuy to stay tuned.
share the video on your social media accounts with your friends and families and make them aware about the upcoming technology. Comment below your feedback, any suggestion you would like to give us or any piece of information you would like to share with us. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned till tomorrow.